Hey, Maleko, I just got off the phone with Coast Guard officials who do tell me the situation is developing. And right behind me, this is the coastline they have been searching. This is a helicopter, one of the search helicopters that has been participating in the efforts to find that missing Black Hawk helicopter. Again, this is for the five people that went down in that Black Hawk helicopter last night. And this is one of those choppers that is participating in the search and rescue efforts. So again, we are two miles west of Ka'ana Point right now, and Ka'ana Point Trail has been shut down completely, and they are on the hunt for that downed Black Hawk helicopter. Wreckage was found around 11.30 p.m. last night, and again, the rescue effort has been extensive, with the Coast Guard leading the search and rescue efforts. That chopper did go down two miles west of Ka'ana Point, as I did say. Now, military officials, they do tell me the 25th Combat Aviation Brigade was conducting a training mission. This was around 9.30 last night between Ka'ana Point and Dillingham Airfield. And that right there, a separate search and rescue aircraft that has been involved in this ongoing search. So you can see it is very busy off the coastline near Ka'ana Point. Look Looking for that down Black Hawk helicopter. Incredibly busy scene. Now, let me take you over here to that road closure I mentioned earlier. This is Mokula'ia Road right here that has been shut down. The trail is closed. They are not letting hikers up to an a point. So, the situation has been extensive and developing. We are keeping track of the very latest. And I did, again, just speak to Coast Guard officials who say they are in the middle of this developing search. In the meantime, I'll send it right back over to you, Maleko. Good morning, Hawaii. A Black Hawk Army helicopter has gone missing with five people on board. And an update from the Coast Guard. Well, they did find a portion of the fuselage and other debris. This is located just two miles west of Ka'ana Point in this region right here. Now, video that we shot from earlier does show rescue boats and also Coast Guard officials and aircraft all looking for that downed Black Hawk chopper. That went down two miles west of Ka'ana Point, as I said. Now, military officials do tell me the 25th Combat Aviation Brigade conducting a training mission around 9.30 last night. This is between Ka'ana Point and Dillingham Airfield. Now, this involved two choppers. One lost communication completely, and the Coast Guard did find debris around 11.30 last night. And again, they did find a part of that fuselage. I was just able to confirm that with Coast Guard officials. In the meantime, let's send it over to Jordan with the very latest in weather. Maleko, the Coast Guard, Army, and Honolulu Fire are all joining forces in this search effort for a downed Black Hawk helicopter near Ka'ana Point. Five people reportedly on board. And right here, this is Mokule'ia Road shut down completely just past Camp Erdman. Now, I'll take you down to the scene of the coast right now. We just saw a search and rescue helicopter flying by us. Again, this, this is the, the coastline right here. Of, um, we are two miles west of Ka'ana Point, and that is where that helicopter went down earlier this morning. So again, if we can take video that we did shoot of the scene as we just arrived, this is uh, this is video that we shot dark out, but it is extremely, um, extremely dark developing as well. The far away, far away lights, they are from a search and rescue boat. And uh, the Coast Guard leading that search this morning where that chopper went down about two miles west of Ka'ana Point. Now, military officials, they do tell me this was a training mission that all took place around 9.30 last night. And officials did find debris in the ocean about two hours later. So again, we are following this, uh, keeping track of the developing situation. This was a military exercise uh, that was reportedly um, taking place when two helicopters, they were uh, lost communication with each other. One lost communication completely. And if I can uh, take you again to the coastline this morning, we did just see a search and rescue crew helicopter pass by us. It just flew by in that direction. And we have have been seeing rescue boats as well going up and down the coast. So this has been an active scene, also an ongoing investigation. Again, a joint effort between HFD, uh, Coast Guard, and Army Resources this morning. So definitely a busy and developing situation that we are keeping track of. And 
Again, you can see Mokulaia Road right behind us. Uh, this is up to the trail of Kaena Point, completely shut down. So you can't get to Kaena Point. We have seen hikers trying to pass by us getting on the trail. And uh, this is uh, not open right now, obviously, because of those search and rescue efforts. So definitely keeping track of this ongoing investigation. Please stay with the Island News. We'll bring you the latest in the next report. Maleko just got off the phone with Coast Guard officials who do tell me that search is ongoing this morning. This is for that down Black Hawk helicopter. And we have seen air crews and boat crews all along this coastline. This is the search area and it continues on. This is two miles west of Kaena Point. Now, if I can lead you over in this direction. This is uh, the road that has been closed to Kaena Point this morning. So hikers have been trying to get on the point and uh, again, they are being turned away because of this extensive search and rescue mission. We are following some breaking news this morning. A Black Hawk helicopter has gone down two miles west of Kaena Point and this right here is the coastline. Search and rescue crews have been scouring. There's a helicopter in the air right there and again this is an extensive search and rescue effort by uh, the Coast Guard Army and Honolulu Fire and right here Mokulei Ear Road has been shut down completely and also the trail as well has been closed. Stay with Island News. We'll be bringing you live updates all throughout the morning.